is underway already. There's been no bell, but all hell is breaking loose. Iceberg just rolled down the entrance ramp. I didn't even get to make the, the introduction, yeah. Mr. Vane. I, I, I noticed that. Iceberg made his entrance rolling, being thrown down the entrance ramp, followed by the humongous angry giant, the priest of punishment, Michael Judas. Well, we know that these two men having bad blood is quite a literal understatement. It was the no pain train iceberg that costed the priest of punishment, Michael Judas, his Anarchy Wrestling Heavyweight Championship whenever he attacked him before his scheduled match with Mike Posey. So you've got to believe that Michael Judas has nothing but evil intentions for the elite iceberg. I don't like how this is turning out, Mr. Vane. I don't like it at all because whenever these men get to fighting, it is never a good thing. Well, as long as I have two legs, I'm loving it because you can get away. And folks, it's like he's grabbing a chair. The people here in Cornelia are loving it. If you watch him at good. home. Oh, gosh. He, he was trying to take Iceberg's head off, for God's sakes. If you're watching this at home and you're having fun watching it, not only can you imagine being oh. here live in Oh, my God. At the Anarchy Arena on Level Grove Road in Cornelia, Georgia, the second and fourth Saturdays of every month. Sound like a shotgun you can be blast. a part of this live. Good night. Oh, for God's sakes. Like a shotgun blast going off in the arena, Jeremy. When a man the size and strength of Michael Judas hits you with a metal chair. Well, here comes the Deadly Sin 7 going right after Michael Judas. And if you notice, as strong as those shots were with the chair, Iceberg never went down. And now, like you say, the Deadly Sin 7 at ringside attacking Judas from behind. Par for the course when you're dealing with the Elite and Jeff G. Bailey. What is it, two on one? Has there even been a bail yet? Good Lord, Michael Judas trying his best to fight back. Wait a minute, there's Sean Tempers. Let's what? make it three on three one. Three on one, this is doomsday spelling for the Priest of Punishment. It's all Elite members right now just there's been no opening bell, so I guess this, this is fair game. This isn't even a match. This is a mugging vein. The Elite are just trying to absolutely pick apart Michael Judas, and I don't like the looks of it one daggum bit. Well, if you're going to pick apart Michael Judas, if that's your game plan, this is the way to this do it. This is not right, Vane. We had a scheduled main event match, and now the Elite are just absolutely have just thrown out the rule book as if they ever needed one in the first place. But when you pick a fight with the priest of punishment, Michael Judas. Oh, God, there's that scalpel vein. You've got to do what you've got to do. He has already bloodied the Mike, Michael Judas with that on one occasion. It looks like he's going to try to do it again. Oh, my God, vein. And what that is, folks, is a freaking knife. Wait a minute. Oh, my God. We haven't seen Jeter in forever. Oh, my God. It's wrestling's most dangerous weapon, Jeter. Oh, no. Is he coming out here Don't to help me. the elite? What's he going to do? We, he's had of his course he's Michael. coming to help the elite. Him and Jeff G. Bailey go way back. The history between these two men, the business relationship. But no, way. he's going after the elite. Wow. Knocking out tippers. Going after Iceberg. Seven into the corner. Jeter ducks it. Huge belly to belly suplex. Wow. I, I, I halfway thought that Jeter was coming to pick the bones of Judas, but that's not the case. Oh, the boot that sends Iceberg all the way to the floor, and Jeff T. Bailey and Camp are retreating. Well, we had a scheduled match, but it looks like for once, Jeter and Michael Judas may be on the same page. What's going on here? Things may not be over. Ladies, ladies. Ladies and gentlemen, I have just been informed that this is a no contest. Not the way the fans wanted to see this one end. The match has been thrown out. Not the way the people watching at home wanted it to end. 